Okay, what kind of dogs we have so far? Well, we've got herding dogs, water dogs, pointers, retrievers, setters, and guard dogs. I see your dog research is continuing. Yes, we have many interesting things in the script, but we're still working on more. Good. I really like the effort you children put in. That reminds me. I have to go finish building the set for the next guest segment. And what might that be? Let me surprise you. Oh. <laughs> oh, I love surprises. <laughs> Is everybody ready for dog day? I'm as doggone ready as I'll ever be. Now let's get on with the show. Okay, pal, let's roll that opening graphic. Three, two, one, and take it. And cue the host. Hey, we're on the air. Now! Good morning and welcome to the Kid Songs TV Show. The one and only show made by kids. For kids. And starring kids. Hi, I'm Sergio Centeno. And I'm Tiffany Burton. And we're the Biggles! We have a great show for you today, and it's all about our lovable furry friends. <laughs> oh shucks! You made a show all about me and Ruby? Oh, aren't you guys great? Not exactly, Billy. Today's show is all about dogs. A little disappointing, but okay. So let's get started. One thing that everybody knows is that if you have a dog, it needs to be walked. Our friend Megan does a great job in our video of Walking, walking the, the dog. dog! Yes, Great Danes are a part of the Mastiff group of dogs who are bred to be big, very big. We're always learning new stuff on this show. The puppies we worked with in this next video were the sweetest. Yeah, they couldn't stop kissing us. You guys sound like you fell in love with these dogs. Yeah, <laughs> we did. Oops, cue the host. Our next video features husky puppies. Siberian huskies first came from a very cold, snowy climate. They have a heavy coat and are very strong and loyal workers. Check them out in... All Shook Up! Well, bless my soul, what's wrong with me? I'm itching like a man on a fuzzy tree. My friends say I'm acting wild as a bug. I'm in love. I'm all shook up. Mm -hmm. Shook up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, 
Thank you very much. Go on in three, two, and two. We asked several experts the question of which dog is the easiest family dog to train, and most answered, the Golden Retriever. Veteran Kid Songs Kid, Katie Polk, trained a Golden Retriever to do some fancy tricks in our next video. The um, best, best dog in the world. Let's see what my dog can do. He's putting on a show for you. dogs and there are so many different varieties. I like the small fluffy ones that I can cuddle. I like the tall slim and graceful ones like the Greyhound and the Great Dane. Do you think it's true that dogs look like their owners? Some do. Then what kind of dog do you picture me having? <laughs> I'm going to have to think about that one Ruby. Hound Dog is next and the host has the script. Alrighty then. <laughs> Let's cue them. Alrighty then. I will in three Two and kill. Our next video stars the charming Basset Hound. Bassets are wonderful at following scents of other animals like rabbits. The short legs make it easy for them to keep their nose to the ground, and the determination helps the job get done. Hey guys, they're not perfect. Wait till you see what a mess was made by this hound dog. You ain't nothing but a hound dog.
anything. Can you, Lana? Not yet. Boy, it's serious in here. What's the matter, guys? We're trying to find out information about this kind of dog, but we don't know what it's called. What you need is an encyclopedia of dogs. Is there such a thing? Sure. There you go. Thanks. Do you remember the video we made a long time ago about little Bo Peep? Who lost her sheep and didn't know where to find them? Absolutely. We should add that to our show. You're right again, pal. I'll tell everyone. Host, make up an intro to little Bo Peep. In three, two, and cue. The Kid Songs Kids made a really beautiful video of the nursery rhyme about little Bo Peep and her very talented sheep herding Border Collie. Border Collies can make sheep move just by giving them a really intense look. Very impressive, little brother. How did you know that? I just read it in a book. Thank you, Billy. We needed that help. And now at last, Little Bobby! <laughs> jump this high? It's hard to believe, but that's what the letter they sent me said. I hope we didn't make a mistake. It's awfully tall. I know. Our next video is all about the farmer in the dell and his wonderful collection of animals. Which includes a beautiful big dog called a Briard. Briards, which were originally bred in France, are known for their fearless and protective nature. For hundreds of years, they've been the companions of leaders of armies, including the French Emperor Napoleon. So watch out for this historical dog in The, the Farmer in the Dell. The Farmer in the Dell, the Farmer in the Dell. Hi ho, the dairy of the Farmer in the Dell. The Farmer takes the wife, the Farmer takes the wife. Hi ho, the dairy of the Farmer takes the wife. The wife takes the child, the wife takes the child. Hi ho, the dairy of the wife takes the child. The child takes the cat. The child takes the cow. Hi ho, the dairy ho. Oh, the child takes the cow. The cow takes the pig. The cow takes the pig. Hi ho, the dairy ho. Oh, the cow takes the pig. The pig takes the dog. The pig takes the dog. Hi ho, the dairy ho. Oh, the pig takes the dog. The dog takes the cat. The dog. Everybody's 
so excited about dogs today. Yeah, everybody loves them. Well, I like dogs, but not when they're bigger than me. Sarah, a lot of children, especially small ones like you, get worried when a big dog runs up to them. I don't like it if I don't know them. I'm afraid they'll knock me over. That's okay, sweetheart. Nobody likes being knocked over by a dog. And I thought it was just me. Ready for the interview? You bet. Stand by to give me the graphic. Ready to roll. Roll it and take it. And cue the host. Today on Question Time, we have two fascinating guests, Police Officer Jack Shanley and his German Shepherd, Gundo. Jack and Gundo have been partners for four years and do all kinds of demanding assignments together. So let's turn the studio over to Minnie Paley and meet today's guest. Thank you, Tiffany and Sergio. And I'd like to introduce Officer Jack Shanley and Gundo. Hi. Hi. Can I pet him? Sure. How old was Gundo when you started working together? He was three and a half, and he's almost eight now, so we've been together for a while. Uh, we've been partners the whole time. I picked him up at the uh, airport, as a matter of fact, and we've been uh, together ever since. Where did you get him? He came from Europe. Uh, specifically, he came from Holland. Why does the Los Angeles Police Department get dogs from Europe? Well, there's several reasons, but the main reason is because Europeans have been using dogs to do this sort of job for years and years and it's actually bred into the dogs where the dogs inside they don't even realize that they know how to do this really well so we go to Europe to get all our dogs. How does Gundo help you in your work? Well Gundo uh, uses his nose and which is very sensitive and he can smell things that we can't and he helps us find uh, bad guys. Is that what you were practicing outside the studio this morning? Yes it was. Brady roll the tape! You can see that we're searching here and practicing in a parking lot, which we often search. And there's Gundo. He's going out ahead of me looking for uh, the bad here. guy in this case. Here. And we'll oh have him go in between the cars here. and try and get him into the areas where the bad guy might be hiding. And he's using his nose to try and find him. Did he find anything outside? Well, not this morning. We were just practicing. Good boy. Very impressive. Thank you very much. What other special abilities does Gundo have? Well, one of the things that Gundo needs to do is be able to jump over things. Uh, things that we might come across during a search. And he has to know how to jump over walls and things like that. Uh, he also has to know how to crawl under things and through things and up steps and balance beams. All sorts of agility type of things. Is he like a pet? Well, in some ways he is. I do take him home with me at night, and he, he's part of my family. Uh, my children like him and everything, but he still has a job to do. And we try and keep him focused on what his real job is, and that's to help policemen uh, do a, find people in a safe way. Thank you, Gundo and Officer Jack, for joining us today. You're very welcome. Well, kids, we learned a lot about dogs and police work. So stay tuned for more fabulous guests on the next Question Time. That was a really good segment. Yeah, and we're moving on. Cue the host. We're heading over to Billy and Rooney's dance studio for a sing-along. And they've picked a great one today. So let's go join them. We love animals, and we know from all the letters you write us that you do too. The main man in this next video has so many, it's unbelievable. You'll love it. It's called Fiddle ID. I'm a big cat and the cat pleased me. I fed my cat in the under tree and the cat went Fiddle ID, Fiddle ID, yeah, and a Fiddle ID. I bought me a hen and the hen pleased me. I fed my hen in the under tree and the hen went clicky clucky and the cat went Fiddle ID, Fiddle ID, yeah. And a I bought me a bird and the bird pleased me I fed my bird of yonder tree And the bird went flippy floppy And the hen went clicky clucky And the cat went fill a dee fill a dee Yee-haw! And a fill a dee There's the bird now! Can you believe he rides a bike? I bought me a lizard and the lizard pleased me I fed my lizard of yonder tree And the lizard went creepy crawly And the bird went flippy floppy and the hen went clicky clucky, and the cat went fill a dee, 
So too. Let's do it, guys. We're running out of time. You got it, boss. <laughs> Cue the host. This next video stars our friend Mike, the very talented border collie. You saw him earlier herding sheep. In this video, he's helping the kids on kids spell. Spell? This dog can spell? He sure can. Watch him in. B I N G O and Bingo was his name. Oh. oh. There were some kids who had a dog and Bingo was his name. Oh. our show dedicated to our doggy friends. I sure did. I'm gonna go ask my mother for a puppy. <laughs> Hold on, Billy. We've got to say bye first. Oops. <laughs> Sorry. Well, kiddos, that's all we have time for on this episode of the Kid Songs TV show. The one and only show made by kids. For kids. And starring kids. And Biggles. See ya. See ya. Bye.
Hi, I'm Sir Joe Centeno. And I'm Tiffany Burton. And we're the Biggles! We want you to know that you can find all your favorite kids' songs music videos on home video. And on DVD, too! So A mom's dream come true. They're the best in the whole wide world. Trust me! And our A Day Act series follows the kids' songs kids on singing and dancing adventures to really fun places like amusement parks and Old MacDonald's Farm. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on his farm he had a cow, E-I-E-I-O, Songs I Can Series 2. It stars me and my big sister Ruby. Check it out! And you take the bread and you spread it, you spread it. Then you take the bread and you spread it, you spread it for your peanut, peanut butter, and jelly. And then you spread it for your peanut, peanut butter, and jelly. Then you take the bread and you spread it, you spread it. Then you take the videos about something kids love, like animals. Let's show the kids some really cute animals. So look for the Colorful Kids Songs logo on your favorite store and join in the sing-along fun. There are 24 different Kids Songs music videos available. And believe you me, you want them all. Remember, you can find all your favorite Kids Songs products in stores and at www.kidsongs.com. The Kids Songs audio and video collection, they're the greatest. See ya! See ya! Bye!